I have my blended data source on Lucre Studio. It is great, but it is not finished. As you can see, there are some null values. Null values are not the same as zero. Zero is a number. Null is nothing. I cannot operate null. Five plus null is not five. Is null. So I need to change this because otherwise I cannot combine a metric that is called total ad spend. Because if I have a null value, then Looker Studio will return a null. I need to fix this. Super simple, don't worry. The first thing I will do is with this table, I will bring the dimension date. And Looker Studio will identify the dimension that is shared across these data sources. And I can also bring in the same table, as you can see, the Google ad spend, the LinkedIn ad spend, and the Facebook ad spend. This is wonderful because I can see the actual values separated by a data source and also I can create a combined metric with all of them. I will show you how to calculate these custom fields on Looker Studio. So I will go to my metrics and I will select the total ad spend I had created. This total ad spend is a simple formula I will show you here that is summing, combining, I don't know how to say it in English, sorry, uh, Google ad spend plus LinkedIn ad spend plus Facebook ad spend. This this seems to be right. It is a simple formula. The issue is that if I have the formula like this, it will still show some null values because remember, null plus five is null. So I need to transform those null values into zeros so I can operate them mathematically correctly. I will go back and I will show you the new total ad spend that I am calculating and you will see this function and you will love it. In this new function, I am doing the same formula. I am summing or adding my LinkedIn ad spend, but I am using a function that is called if null. If null is a function that says, if null for this metric, if, if it is null, then turn it to zero. And I am doing that with all of the metrics. If LinkedIn ad spend is null, turn it to zero. If Google ad spend is null, turn it to zero. And with Facebook, if it is null, turn it to zero again. And that's how you can fix your blends when uh, getting null values on your formulas. With this fix and with this new field, now we can create chart like these ones, where over time I can see my total ad spend by channel. And this is the first class of data blending on Looker Studio. In other classes, I will show you how to fix other issues that you will find, how to use other join operators. And I think that you will be an expert on data blending on Looker Studio. So I will see you in the next classes. I am so excited to show you this.